Hello guys, today in this video I'm going to show you how to install a custom modded Discord client and it's actually really easy. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to search for Vancord or go to Vancord.dev and we're going to press the download Vancord button. Once you press it, you're basically going to select your platform, mine is Windows, and download Vancord installer.exe. Now once it's downloaded, we're going to close Discord, make sure Discord is not running and only then we can run the application. So press it and you're going to see this window that pops up. We're going to select stable and it basically automatically finds the location of Discord installed on your device. Then we're going to click install. And if you see this message, the install is success. Just press OK. And the next thing I recommend you to do is install OpenASR, although this is optional. This is going to speed up your Discord and remove all of the unneeded things. And I just recommend using it. I'm going to install OpenASR. So click accept and we're pretty much done here. We can close it off this now. And now we can go to Discord and see that we have installed the Vancord. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to user settings. And then I can see the Vancord category. As you can see, I've got everything here, plugins, themes, and that's basically what we need. In the plugins, you can basically enable plugins. that are already pre-installed into the application. You can enable them, select them, edit them, and etc. The one I really recommend is the message logger. It's going to log all the messages and basically keep track of all the messages, even if someone deletes them. Then next, themes. If you want a custom Discord theme, uh, basically like Opera, GX or any other theme, you can pretty much download themes from discordthemes.com, press download. We're going to get a CSS file. And now we can pretty much go into Vancord, open themes folder, and we can move this CSS file over here and we're going to have that theme. So yeah, you can also go to online themes, but it's not ready yet. And yeah, this is it for a tutorial. I hope you liked this. I made this pretty quickly. Hope you liked the video, share the video, comment the video. And yeah, we're pretty much done here. So goodbye, guys.